A dangerous combination of tinder dry conditions, strong winds, and record high temperatures is complicating efforts of crews in Alberta, trying to get a handle on more than 70 wildfires currently raging across the province and forcing thousands from their homes. CTV's Alberta Bureau Chief Bill Fortier now on the flames and the fears. By mid-afternoon, approaching wildfire threatened to cut off barges from the Little Red River Cree Nation, the main escape route from the community. We only have approximately 30 minutes prior to the barge crossings being overrun. The Northern Alberta First Nations chief giving regular updates on Facebook. Fires out of control. As local officials worked on getting nearly 4,000 people to safety, even asking anyone with a boat to help. This is our last ditch effort. After taking this video of the fire approaching, Brian Grandjam got out with his grandmother. I'm worried about the community to get burned down. That fire is one of dozens burning across the province, at least 17 of them out of control. In central Alberta, this wildfire flared up again today, forcing more evacuations. There's some damage on this end. These residents were allowed to return home today after being forced out yesterday. The fire coming dangerously close to their home. There was like black clouds of smoke and it was, it was honestly very hellish. In Banff, wind blew a controlled burn out of control, threatening a hotel and a stable. And even the big cities can't escape the extreme fire risk brought on by dry, hot weather. Several brush fires have started in Edmonton. This one forced the closure of a freeway. Edmonton hit a record 30 degrees today and above average temperatures are expected to continue for much of the province, making the conditions extremely dry and driving up the risk of more wildfire. Bill Fortier, CTV News, Edmonton.